good day everyone hoping everyone is fine in my this video i am going to show you how to create a video for creating a video you need the zoom software and you need a laptop laptop if you want to use the desktop computer so you make sure that you have microphone and speaker connected to it you cannot use mobile phones because in mobile phones you have very limited facility and uh, you cannot share your textbook and other files so when you are ready with your uh, laptop and zoom software just start a meeting start a meeting remember that will be a individual meeting you don't have to add any participant in that meeting and when you start the meeting take the speaker microphone and speaker support um, uh, support from the uh, menu when you start the meeting so after start the meeting you you come to your main screen and in bottom of your screen you you can see there is a record recording option is given so you just click on the record button and the recording will be start remember when the record when the recording starts that you have to start your video first of all you can greet greet in your video and you can give your introduction speech and other information that you want to share you can share at that time after sharing all the information and your introduction speech when you want to share something you you want to write something or you want to show something you have to go again the bottom of the screen there are number of options given in the middle you can see a green button and sit and share screen click on that button i'm clicking on that button now when you click on that button you you can see now in this video you cannot see those option uh, but when you do uh, make your video you can see the those options just you have you have the desktop uh, uh, first then you have whiteboard and other options are given here so suppose you want to write something so click give a single click on whiteboard and there is a share button bottom of the screen click on share button so now you can see there is a uh, a whiteboard has uh, come into my video so in the top of the whiteboard you have number options given text select or spotlight eraser many of the options are given suppose you want to type something so click on the text button and click on the screen so after clicking on the screen you have a you have a cursor blinking there so you can type whatever you like this suppose i'm typing topic uh, input device like you can type and you can type more so after working with this whiteboard when you are done with the whiteboard you have uh, when you want to go to the main screen again there is a in the top of the screen you can see there is a stop share option so click on the stop share and you can at that time you can you will be you will be coming back to your main screen when you come back to your main screen now if you want to share anything else suppose any file or any video from uh, from your computer so you have to go to the share screen again click on the share screen and select desktop and click on the share button like the like previous previous one click share button and now you you have come to the desktop and whatever the thing suppose if you want to show something from your browser just open your browser this is my browser you can uh, search anything or you can go go to youtube you can write youtube or you can you can share a video from here so like this you can share other option too you can show you can uh, you can sh uh, show your text uh, textbook also like if you uh, if you have opened your textbook 
So just go to Adobe Reader and you can show the textbook from here. After showing the things, uh, when you have done sharing the other options, you have to stop share. Click on the stop share button. So when you click on stop share, it will come to the main screen again. Now from here, uh, uh, when you are done with your, uh, you have to give the conclusion and uh, uh, and everything that you want to share. When your meeting is done, when your video is completed, then you have to press on the stop button. There is a push button also. So you in between your meeting, you can you can pause pause your video. But when you want to stop completely your meeting, you have to stop the uh, recording. So I'm not stopping now because when if I stop my recording now, it will be stop here. So when you're done, you click on the stop button and the meeting will be and that video will stop. But uh, you'll be you'll, you'll be here. You'll be here for the moment. And the right side of your screen, there is a red end meeting is given. So after stopping your video, you have to press on the end meeting button. When you press on the end meeting, then after press, after stopping the meeting, when you press on the end meeting, it will stop the zoom. It will stop the zoom, and before it stop the zoom, it will uh, it will make your video. It will whatever the video that you have done, it will create your video, and it will store in your my document store in my document and the, that file will automatically open for you like this you can uh, create the video these are the very, very easiest tool that you can do uh, i hope you all understand and if you need any further uh, further help further help you can call me i will help you help you out so thank you very much guys this is shanwa sir so uh, today uh, uh, I'm going to stop the meeting now. So I'm going to stop the meeting recording.